all the pieces of timber that will support the floor and roof panels are in place now, epoxied in. The gussets are also in place. So these are going to be the support for the cockpit floor. Below here, that's going to be the lid for the water container and the lid for the battery bank. The two pieces of timber at the bottom there are going to be support for the water compartment floor and the battery compartment floor. So there's going to be panels on top and I'm going to put uh, foam, expanding foam underneath the panels. First two panels are epoxied in, water storage compartment and the battery compartment. Okay, I jumped ahead a bit on the work I've done. So I have epoxied complete inside, well, almost complete. And next up is putting in the cockpit floor. So the first part I've done. That's in, fixed in place. The second part however, as I'm doing everything alone, this is, I'm doing it. So I put it in an angle that way the wood on which it's going to be fixed is free. I'm going to put epoxy on top of these parts and over there and of course on this one and then I'm going to lower plywood panel. So again hopefully this works. Both cockpit floor panels are in place now. Second one, smaller part is down there. Another thing I did was close the top part of the aluminum frame bulkhead. So the bricks are just to put the, to keep the wooden panels in place until the glue is hardened. The only thing I have to do now, that's left to do, is fill up some holes where the epoxy dripped down. Should be fairly easy. So normally tomorrow the cockpit floor is finished. This concludes this video update. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check out my Facebook page, my Google Plus page and website for more. As always, calm seas, fair winds and have a good one.